This is Miami All Access. All right, we're here with Coach Cleve Wright and freshman guard Kayla Brown after a 60-54 uh, to 54 loss to Central Michigan. Coach, your opening statement on tonight's game. Um, I, I think uh, I was pleased with the way our team executed the game plan that we wanted to do against Central Michigan. Um, I thought that was good. Uh, I think we certainly um, uh, had some opportunities that we did not take advantage of, uh, that we need to take advantage of. Um, but I thought our, our, our players played hard. I thought we had good effort. Um, and I thought we stayed connected. Even when we did uh, lose connection with each other, we did reconnect. Um, and the focus, like I said, on the game plan was really good. Clearly, um, we didn't shoot the ball well in the first half, didn't finish at the rim. Uh, and um, we also, in the second half, didn't box out. Uh, did a great job on the boards in the first half. It limited them to one offensive board and gave up 16 in the second half. And that's tough. That's tough to win a game like that. But um, certainly we had some things that we need to, uh, that we can get better at. Uh, Central Michigan's a great team. Uh, uh, Crystal Bradford's a great player. Um, she creates a lot of things for them. And, um, and they made the plays when they needed to. Now, one thing you can talk about is the uh, defensive effort for the team. You held Central Michigan to 60, which is well below their uh, season average. Talk a little bit about just the overall defensive effort that you saw the team had. Well, I mean, I, th I think we take, took away some things that they like to do, um, and and tried to get them to do some things that um, that they did a lot you know, that they have had to do. And so, um, I, I thought the effort on on the end, holding them to 60 points, that was that was really solid. And you know, if if in the second half, if we give up half those offensive rebounds, if we give up eight, which isn't good at all either, and still they would have ended it with nine, that would have been eight more possessions less that they would have had. And what, I, what we need to do is have our players understand how important possessions are and, um, and how um, not that we want to play you know, all tight or whatever, but just how important it is um, to not give up rebounds and to also work hard to get a good shot on the offensive end. All right, well, shots weren't falling in general, but you did have 12 three-pointers thanks to uh, six total from Courtney Larson and five from Kayla Brown. Yes. Uh, can you talk a little bit about those two and how those two helped keep you in this game? Absolutely. I thought um, I'll start off with Courtney. I thought Courtney, uh, as a game, she didn't hesitate at all tonight. Um, did a great job of getting her feet set and knocking down a shot and, and, and knocking down shots and taking big shots. Um, certainly that was a, a big key in the second half, keeping us in the game. And then uh, Kayla came off the bench and just, again, got her feet set, didn't hesitate, um, didn't shy away from it, um, and, uh, and took good shots. And uh, she's a good shooter. I want her to get her elbow up a little bit more, but she's a good shooter. So a very good shooter. And I just think, I just think she has a lot of guts. I, I think she has a lot of guts, and I think she wants to, uh, um, to help her team. Kayla, how did it feel to uh, finally get that three-point shot going and hitting a career-high 17 points? Yeah, it was nice to see the ball go on the rim. But um, my teammates did a great job getting me in the right positions to look for the three and just hitting me at the right times. All right. And talk about the uh, sort of the defensive effort um, throughout the game, just trying to hold, obviously, a very strong offensive team with a Wade Watch, a player that's one of the top 50 players in the nation, to only 60 points. Yeah, we focused a lot on defensive transition and um, clogging the paint to help slow them down. And we tried to take care of um, Crystal Bradford. That's right. Last name. Yes. <laughs> um, focused a lot on her. And we did a great job in the first half of boxing out, but in the second half we need to box out better. All right, so um, another strong offensive team coming in on Saturday against Akron. Mm -hmm. What is, uh, are you going to work on in the next couple of days, and what do you need to get prepared for to face them? Well, cert certainly Akron a, is a very good team. Uh, they've had a, a great year so far. Uh, they like to push the ball. They have some shooters. Um, and of course, they have their, uh, one of their seniors back that uh, I think are King, uh, and she's a good player. And so we'll have to we'll have to be ready for that. And you know, of course, I, you know, you're asking me a question about Akron, and mm -hmm. I, I got I still got to watch this film, right. so I can't really say that much. All right, thank you, Coach. Thank you, Kayla. Thanks, Mike.